Hi, and welcome to Mindful Mondays. My name is Tanya, and today we are going to practice a meditation using my favorite meditation tool. This is a Muse headband. It's a brain-sensing headband. Um, here's the box, the picture on it. So it attaches behind the ears and around the forehead to kind of keep track of your brain wave activity and it helps guide you through meditation in order to give you some feedback using sound to let you know if you are paying attention to your breath or not. So I thought it would be fun to have a little um, practice with this today to show you how it works and maybe encourage you to go out and get your own. So let's start. How are you feeling about the session today? You might be aiming for a perfectly calm session. This is totally natural. But the truth is, everyone gets distracted when they meditate. Training your mind is kind of like training a puppy. You set the puppy down and tell it to stay, but eventually it runs away. Then you kindly and gently set it down and tell it to stay again. But then, of course, it runs away again. You know it's going to take a while to train the puppy, so you don't worry about it too much. You just keep repeating the exercise. Getting angry at the puppy isn't going to get you anywhere. Meditation with Muse is similar. Just keep repeating the exercise. The nature of the mind is to wander and drift. It takes time to rewire your brain. No need to be self-critical or worry about a tough session. Instead, enjoy the process, be curious, and explore. When you're ready, find a relaxed position and close your eyes. For this session, simply notice when the weather gets intense and your mind has wandered. Then bring your attention back to your breath, gently and kindly, as if you were training a puppy. Ready? Place your attention on your breath now. Well done. Think back to the session. How do you usually respond when you notice the weather change? There are two ways you can respond to distraction. You can be kind and gentle, or you can be self-critical. Let's try exploring this on the next screen. When viewing your session results, if you notice yourself becoming self-critical at any point, pause and remember not to take your results so seriously. Your data is simply here to help you reflect on your meditation and motivate yourself. Tap the arrow to see your data. So it links up to my phone and it shows me the data of my brain waves. So you can see the chart and you can see the active, neutral and calm mind. I was relatively calm whenever I went into the neutral space is when I was beginning to get distracted. And then when the weather would change, 
I would bring myself back to my breath and you would hear things like birds chirping. Um, and the, when the birds chirp, it lets you know that you're back in a calm state of mind. So that was a three minute meditation, it was very short, but um, it says two minutes and 22 seconds, I was in a calm state, 38 seconds, I was in a neutral state, and I wasn't in an active state at all. And so it lets you save your data, so it tracks it every day that you practice, it keeps um, a tally of how many points you've earned, how many minutes that you've um, been in a calm state, in a neutral state, and in an active state. And it sends you little reminders and little motivations. So I think this is a really great app and a really great product. And so I just wanted to share that with you today for our Mindful Monday practice. I hope you got some uh, inspiration out of it. Um, I especially like this one because it is about training a puppy and to be gentle with that puppy. Um, and your mind is kind of like a puppy. It's going to just keep wandering and it's just your job or your practice to keep bringing it back as often as it runs away. You just gently bring it back and sit it down and it gets easier with practice. So I hope you find time in your busy schedule on this Monday to Sit down and just focus on your breath for three minutes and I will see you next week for our mindfulness practice.